Hey guys, it's Carlos CDC. Today I was gonna do a review of the S2R2 baton in copper, but I don't feel like I have enough experience with it yet to do a full review. So what you're getting today is a pocket dump. Now, if you guys don't know what a pocket dump is, is basically when a um, everyday carry enthusiast empties his pockets and either takes a photo or a full video like I am doing right now. But uh, let's get to it right away. I know everybody wants to see the pocket knife right away. And for the pocket knife today, basically the last pocket dump of the year I'll be doing, uh, I'm carrying the PM2. Uh, PM2 is a very classic knife. Uh, this one has S35V and steel. It's got 12 carbon fiber, compression lock. It has an aftermarket lynch clip and titanium. It's something I really enjoy carrying. It's my go-to ADC wise. Uh, the next thing I'm carrying is my hanky. This hanky is from PD Hanks. It's one of my, an unboxing of this hank. It's one of my most viewed videos, link right there. But I really enjoy his hankies, they're really classy. He makes them in Texas, very affordable. This one likes, this one was $15, just very nice classy hanky. Where my money goes currently is this full shell Cordovan wallet. You can fit cash in it, fold it once, a lot of cards. Oh my, you can see my name. For a wallet, I'm carrying the wooden steel in, um, folding wallet. Full shell Cordovan with uh, a stamp from Horween. On the review, I said that it, this stamp was given by Wooden Steel themselves, but no, this stamp actually is from Horween themselves. So, so beautiful stamp shell Cordovan is very special, special material. It comes out of the rum of a horse. Uh, it's pretty expensive and but it's super nice if you want to experience it i recommend it also don't forget to subscribe guys it's just a little button down below to subscribe in red and just press that and yeah you can watch more pocket dumps more everyday carry reviews more knives more a lot of things really and as for the headphones guys i've been carrying these things for a long time i love these things these things are awesome it is the Jaybird Vistas. They're waterproof, um, dustproof, you know, a little shockproof. I have this one outside already. But I actually, at work, I was working at a ranch and I dropped them. I'm a construction worker in Arizona, by the way. And I dropped them. And it was raining. And I couldn't find them. I'm like, maybe tomorrow I'll have better luck. So I waited a full day. And then I found them. And they were under about three inches of muddy Arizona water. And... I let it dry a little bit and then it just fired right up. It turned on. They're pretty dirty. Again, I'm in construction, um, so I apologize for that. But it's kind of a matchy matchy deal I have going on. And as for my keys, my keys I have this uh, key carrier from Lotus and Lane. It's patinaed very uh, weirdly. This is ghost leather. Um, and I just have one key for my Xterra, and that's all I carry. I don't like keys. And finally, wristwatch check. This is a Bulova Precisionist that my dad gave me for Christmas a few days ago. It's not really my style, however, I have been enjoying it. Uh, the second hand moves like a mechanical watch, however, it is very much a battery powered watch. It is a chronograph, a tachymeter, uh, shows the date right there, it's so a 24, I haven't fixed the date. I need to watch like a review on it and a manual video on it. I just haven't, I've just been enjoying it. It's pretty big. Let me know in the comments if you guys want a wristwatch review of this thing. If not, I'm still going to do it because why not? <laughs> Let's be honest. But this is my pocket dump for today, guys. Um, thank you guys for watching. And don't forget to like the video, comment, and subscribe. If you've seen a few of my videos uh, already, you know, you're going to keep watching them, you know, in the future. So just, you know, subscribe. Um, also, oh, I can't wait to review this thing. This thing is going to have a positive review, 100%. It is a lovely, lovely flashlight, 11... 50 lumens just a nice nice overall flashlight but i feel like i need more experience with it before giving it a full review um i just want to app up the quality of the content review wise in my channel but yeah i hope you guys have a great day again this was my pocket dump let me know what you guys are carrying for you know almost the year's gonna end 2020 let me know what your last um 
pocket dump is for 2019.